Good day to you guys. It's your friend Apobembe again. Hope I meet you well today. Yeah, a big congratulations to Quida's users. If you are one of Quidditch's, big congratulations to you. Now, you must have been wondering if you had, if you had coins, you have money on Quida's. You must have been wondering how you're going to go about it. You may want to probably do one of two things with your money. And to go about withdrawing your money from Quidditch may be a problem. And also, sending coins to third party may be a problem. No, sending coins to someone that has not verified may be a problem on the platform. You know, when CBN came into picture, when CBN came into the picture, what Kuda suggested initially was, okay, if you have Naira in your wallet and you want to withdraw, all you have to do is, all you have to do is check if there is any Kuda's member on the platform that wants to buy. For example, if I want to withdraw 10,000 Naira from a Quidditch Naira wallet, all I have to do is see if there's any Quidditch users that is about to or that wants to that wants to deposit 10,000 Naira. All I have to do is deal, make a deal with that person. The person send the money to me. I transfer the coin or the Naira to his account but then the suggestion was not taken too seriously because there will be there will be no there was no verification of who you are sending coins or money to no we know what things are we know how things are in this present age scamming fraud everywhere and then but now the big solution is here you'll be hearing Binance peer to peer, Passful peer to peer, Remitano peer to peer. Now we have our own Quidas peer to peer trading platform. As a Quidas member, withdrawing and depositing money to the platform won't be a problem any longer. And that's because Quidas has decided, has taken it upon them to find us a solution. And the solution is the use of peer to peer trading platform of Quidas. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can make use of the peer-to-peer -peer platform. But if you prefer reading articles, if you prefer reading step-by-step -step guides to watching video, there's a link in the description under this video. Just click on it. Already published an article how you can make use of the Quidditch peer-to-peer platform. That said, let's get started. So when you log into your peer-to-peer, -peer, when you log into your Quida, sorry, when you log into your Quida's account, it brings you to a page like this. Log on to Quida's on your browser. Before we go further, I would let you to know that before you can make use of the Quida's peer-to-peer, you must be on level, level 3 verification. You must be a level 3 verified user of the platform. In the level 1, your basic information will be collected. Level two, your BVN will be collected. So if your level two was waived, you probably have to do your level three, which which has to do with you submitting your national identity documents. That is to make sure, <coughs> excuse me, that is to make sure who does know you, who does know your real identity, who does know they are dealing with how you can be found should anything go wrong now don't forget before you can make use of quidditch peer-to-peer -peer, you must be level three verified member of the platform and then presently at the time of making this video at the time of this recording the peer-to-peer -peer is not activated on quidditch app yet although we have we have the other book activated on Quidditch app, but the peer-to-peer -peer, at this time is yet to be implemented into the Quidditch app. But not to worry, you can make use of the browser, just I will be doing now to explain everything to you. Now, when you want to make use of your Quidditch peer-to-peer, -peer, log on to your browser, quidditch.com, 
when you go to grass.com i'm sure you know how to log in click on these three dots you see a login link here now when you log when you are logged into your quidas account you're going to see these options so when you click here more options for you your account your transaction is free promo support if you want to contact support if you want to sign out okay then this is where you find your wallet this is where you find the other book don't forget when a browser and the browser i recommend is chrome make use of your chrome browser if you don't have installed on your play store go google ios and then now the latest in town the latest option now is the peer to peer p2p and i was trying to i was trying to check how it is this that's why you can see a green one there now to make use of this peer to peer you no know, you can make use of it as a buyer and as a seller you want to buy and you want to sell and now for you to for you to probably use this you are not buying other currencies you are not buying other coins and you will not be buying any other files currency except naira all you have to do if you want to buy if you want to deposit come to the peer-to-peer -peer, buy from anyone that you you are cool with this is your criteria buy with your naira account then when you have the when you have the nera in your nera wallet you can then from there go to your other book if you know how to make use of the other book there was a video i made on how to make use of the other book you also find the link in the description under this video but if you don't care about using the other book as long as you have the money in your nera wallet you can make use of the instant buy and sell with us and then when you say when you sell your coin on the with us it will not be time for you to withdraw and then to withdraw you now come to the peer-to-peer -peer market still on quitters then you place your order to say when someone when someone is interested in your order the person is usually is definitely going to patronize you the, don't forget the peer-to-peer -peer is just like a black market you know you set your own price you set your own price the way you want it to be i also said the criteria you set the bank account you want the money to be sent to now when you log in when you are logged into your quitters account you see these options now you click on p2p you see offers those it means the offers in the peer-to-peer -peer market my offers it means your off the offers you've created and then my trades it means the trade you've performed either buying or selling now when you click on offer okay this this is the main this is the main quitters pay to pay platform as a matter of fact you can just enter in your browser quitters.com for slash p2p can see this is the main are you seeing it are you seeing it guys okay let me explain these stuff here now this is the buy this is a section for example if you want to buy click on buy when you click on buy and you scroll down you see offers that have been made by other quidders users uh, this ice cream this username is ice cream he has made 319 trades and then 7.21 completed don't forget this quidders to could quidders pay to play market was launched around around 10 p.m around 10 p.m around 10 p.m on 23rd of march okay that was when it was long so this another offer these people these are the people you can buy from 
if you, if you are okay with the criteria they give these are the people you can buy from you can see if you are okay okay this person is selling 0.98 per one naira so if you buy you're still going to gain 0 0.02 0.02 naira 0.02 naira per one naira you buy so you're still gonna gain if you patronize this person you can see you can see and when you are using quitters peer to peer be be rest assured your money is saved quitters will make sure everything is done perfectly no one is cheating anyone now that's for the buy section when you click on the sell section you also see okay you can also see the sell section you can use the sell section if you want to sell you can use the buy if you want to buy now what's what's these parameters for this is where you enter the amount for example if you want to buy or sell you enter the amount here your currency will always be in naira presently for now it will always be in naira now payment method it will be in back transfer you click on back transfer now choose the location of the person probably in nigeria don't need to change the location then you enter the amount you want to buy then let's say you want to buy five thousand 5000 naira then you click on find when you click on find offers you can now scroll down and see if you scroll down and see okay hope you're following and now this place is the currency section will be in naira now the next thing for you to do if you want to sell if you want to sell you have to create an offer Okay, you, want, you want to create you want to create just like an advertisement your personalized advertisement that you want to you want to sell or buy a coin now when you click on make an offer you can see what we like to do to buy or sell let's say you want to sell when you click on sell you choose your currency which will be in naira don't forget you can only sell for now maybe as time goes on with us you upgrade upgrade the peer-to-peer -peer platform for now you can always sell or buy your naira you can only sell or buy naira you cannot sell or buy coins presently don't forget that okay, you want to deposit you want to withdraw that's the major function of this peer-to-peer -peer market now when you, when you when you set if if you want to sell you choose the currency what currency would you like to be paid for you want your money to be in naira okay now you scroll down again you choose you choose your payment method then you choose click on bank transfer when you click on bank transfer you select the bank here you add a bank when you click on adding a bank you can see you select the bank you want your account name your account number let me let, let, let me sound a note of one to you if you don't want to have any issue with this pair to pair make sure you are using a bank account that has the name that correlates with your quidders account Make sure that your quitters information correlates with the bank account you are using. Don't go and use another person's bank account for transaction online. No, for example, if if my name is Obembe Sunday D on quitters and I want to send money to you, I'm using maybe John Okoro to send money. The name does not correlate. If I'm not careful, I may end up losing that money right so make sure you are using 
the account the account details that correlate with your quidas bank account hope you get that right so you choose the account name account number then you click on save bank when you click on save your bank your bank will be the information will be here now you can also add another payment method if you have more than two banks account if you have more than two bank accounts you can so if one account is not going for example if one bank is having an issue with transaction the other will not so okay when you are done with your payment method you choose your pricing option do you want the price to be fixed or do you want it to be floating and now they explain what the meaning of the fixed and floating price means floating price means your offer will your first price will change according to the market price of the asset. Hope you following. It will change according to the be to be going according to the market price. Okay, and then your fixed price means your fire price is locked when you create it and uh, it won't change the, with market price. Your fixed price will not change no matter how no matter what the market is saying. Now, for example, if I want to sell my one error as one error point, I may decide to want to sell my one error as this. Okay, and I may decide to say I want to sell my one error as 0 0.95. Okay, it's my own decision. No, it's a, it's a black market, pay to pay is a black market. You set the price yourself. Now, when you are done with the price, you want to sell your Nera. It means, this means one Nera is equal to 0 0.95 Nera here. It means whoever is coming to buy from me will gain 0 0.05 Nera. Okay, the person is gaining whoever is buying from me is gaining will be following now you set the minimum amount you set the minimum for example if i have like hundred thousand i may set my minimum amount to be ten thousand so the minimum anyone can buy from me will be ten thousand naira. now you set the maximum amount and i just just to chip in this if you have for example if you want to sell hundred thousand naira on quidas it is not that you will sell everything at once although it may happen that someone may want to buy hundred thousand naira and your farm may be <coughs> your farm may be fortunate you may be fortunate you may be fortunate for that person to see your offer and if not the money will go your 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 hundred thousand naira will not be bought at once. It may comes in as based on your minimum and maximum. It may be coming as ten thousand, twenty thousand, fifty thousand. As people, that's it depends on how people wants to buy. It depends on how much people wants to buy. It does not mean you set you want to sell your fifty thousand naira and you are expecting someone to just buy that fifty naira at once. No, it may takes it may take some trades. May take some trades before your your offer can be completely executed on the peer-to-peer -peer market. Now, when you set the minimum, you set the maximum, which is exactly the amount of money you want to sell. Now, when you do that, you set the time here. You time you set the window time for payment. For example, if you are someone that is if you are someone that is not always constant online, you may put something like 31 hour on your time for on your time window for payment. But if you are someone like me that is always online, you may put 15 minutes, 30 minutes. So when the person makes the payment to you, that's how long such person is expected to wait. For the transaction can be completed that's how long is expected to wait okay it's when you set the time here you enter the parameters 
you enters your terms of the of the offer. This is where you enter your terms of the offer. Okay, I'll show you an example of one offer to see how the terms will look like. Now, here's where you give the instruction, and one of the most important instruction is don't include anything related to crypto bitcoin in the transaction description very very important this is where you make the instruction <clears throat> and when when that is done you click on published when you click on that see you want to publish your file immediately you tick it and you, when you are done with that you you will review your offer when you are done reviewing it you click on create offer that's it guys that's simply how you make use of readers peer to peer to either sell or buy now let's go back and look at at an example of an offer there so as i zoom i want to buy from along this second person i want to buy from him Okay, well, the person has almost one million naira, and the lowest, the limit, the minimum he selling is ten thousand naira. So let's assume I want to buy from him. When I click buy, okay, I will enter the amount I want to buy here. When I enter the amount I want to buy here, this place with this, okay. Let me say I want to buy ten thousand naira. See, I will pay him ten thousand naira. He will receive ten thousand naira. You see, when you do that, I want to show you the terms. Okay, you can see the description of that offer, the price, the limit, payment method, payment window, terms. You say please don't don't put anything related to crypto in the description very very important though that should have been in the instruction also okay about the seller i also be giving info about the seller his username number of trades he has made feedback positive and negative you can see so when you do that all you have to do is click on okay let's test it i'm not buying previously but let's test States. let's go back to someone that has that's lesser that's lesser limits okay this person has lesser limits ice cream okay let's say you want to buy 500 and you've gone through okay you can see the terms of service destruction okay the destruction here is kindly use the chat box provided to contact me if there's anything you need while the trade is on if you're following you can also chat with the person you are transacting with and the pair to pay market now you click on buy and click on confirm you click on okay I click on OK. I want to show you something went part. wrong. Please try again. I click on OK. You can see gives you the information. Give you the amount you pay. Says the number of time, the number of minutes left. Then give you a warning. Do not include any words like crypto, Bitcoin, cryptocurrency in the transaction description. And now the payment method for this vendor, the person is using Providence Bank. You see, you see that you can see everything about this offer, the trust trade ID. Okay. Now, when you enter it like that, I will go to my I'll go to my bank app or use my US USSD mobile bank transfer to pay him 500 naira. I'll send the money to this 
bank account then when i'm done for example if he's using different banks here you pick the one for example if he's using gtb and i want to pay that gtb i will choose the gtb account so when you make the payment when you make the payment and you are debited you come to this place again and you click on paid when you click on paid when you click on paid what will happen next is that quidas will notify this vendor ice cream it will notify this vendor that so 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 so, so person your usual name was also displayed to him so 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 person has paid so 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 amount then when he confirmed it the money will be released into my naira wallet all right it's as simple as that and then when you want to connect with this vendor all you have to do is click on live chat when you click on live chat you can start your messaging here then you start if you have any personal question you want to ask him if you need to connect with him or whatsapp or anywhere you do so guys that's simply how you can make use of quidas peer-to-peer that's how you can make use of quidas peer-to-peer platform now you don't have any problem now after buying when you are buying it means you want to deposit money to your quidas account so after the transaction is done you can then go to your quidas wallet or other book to make pay to make trade to make use of the other book to buy any coins of your choice you want to buy a drone you want to buy a dash you want to buy bitcoin you want to buy bitcoin you can then go ahead from there to trade now when you are done trading you then come back when you are done trading and you want to withdraw your money you then come back to this peer-to-peer -peer section again and place an offer to sell your money when you place an offer to sell your money when someone wants to buy same when someone when someone finds your criteria cool within or person would pick you as one of the vendors wants to buy from person pay to you the person goes through this process we've discussed the money will be in your account and that's it if you want to deposit again you go through the same process that's it guys that's simply how you can make use readers peer-to-peer please if you have any question kindly drop in the comment section below i'll be glad to answer and don't forget in the description of this video there's a link there's a link to the video on how you can place other i can make use of quidas other book on the app and also on the browser version version like this also if you want to know how to trade cryptocurrency like a pro if you want to learn how to trade it there's a script there's a link in the description of this video that links to my course on my moneybot.com from there you can become a member become a basic opinion member of my moneybot.com and you have access to my cryptocurrency trading classes don't forget guys if you like this video kindly like it if you dislike it let me know so i will know when i where to improve and don't forget to click on the subscribe button so that you'll be the first to know whenever i release videos like this love you see you in the next video